welcome back to my channel so today I am gonna be doing another Halloween tutorial so I'm gonna be doing a Halloween one again um, I'm not a hundred percent sure what I'm gonna do I know I want to do pretty but gory so I will be doing a photo shoot today with one of my friends and so she needs something scary what to come up with so, if you want to see what I'm going to do, keep on watching my video. Okay guys, I'm back and what I went ahead and did is, I went ahead and did this eye um, and put them contact on this one. Because um, this side is probably going to be the nice and pretty side. I'm going to go ahead and with my Rimmel pencil and nude. And I'm kind of going to outline where I want it to be. I'm kind of going to do it like I did the other one where I kind of cut it out. But instead of having no makeup on this side and makeup on the side that I kind of, you know, had cut out, um, it's going to be gory on this side. So let's go ahead. Let me sharpen it. Okay. On there. So I think this is a side. And so everywhere else, I'm gonna go ahead and put foundation. Okay guys, so I'm back. I went ahead and just applied foundation kind of everywhere else that is not gonna have this. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do is get like a flat brush and get me get you some latex. And what I'm gonna go ahead and do is just kind of apply that. On the places that, I, that I'm going to use it. Ooh. And then, look at that. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and cut up some tissue paper. And what I'm going to go ahead and do is just stick it on there. I kind of cut it in a strip. And I folded it in half. Okay guys, so I'm back. I am, I went ahead and did everything around and I'm waiting for it to dry. But I'm gonna go ahead and do on the inside as well. I was just gonna do the outside, but let's make it more fun. So we can add little spots here and there, anywhere you want. So I'm gonna go ahead and just finish up here, here and there, and I'll be right back. I'm back, and I'm just gonna go in with my foundation and kind of start dabbing on the parts where it's already kind of dry. These are wet, but it does. This doesn't even have to be perfect, cause we are gonna put blood and all that on it. You just kind of have to get it a little bit of your skin color which is looking a little different because of the yellow tissue paper, but yeah, it will work. So it doesn't have to be perfect, cause see?
Okay, so I'm gonna go in with the same red we used last time, and just my little flat brush. And we're gonna go all in. You can just kinda go anywhere on the inside because we are gonna be cutting some of those parts, so it's not gonna be a big deal. I went ahead and took off my nose ring as well because, well, it'd be weird to have a nose ring <laughs> while your face is like this. Okay, so now let's add a little bit. Well, actually, while I'm already here, I'm gonna start. A, I'm gonna go ahead and get this little. God, I can't. I just forgot the name. Um. Yeah, I forgot the name. Can't even believe that. Anyways, we're gonna go ahead and start kind of peeling a little bit of it off. Not all the way, but just some where it looks a little, you know, lifted and creepy. Okay, so this kind of looks a little bit lifted and all. Just be careful not to get your skin, guys. Okay, so now we are going to go in with a little bit of black and I'm just going to go in a little bit on the areas that's a little bit lifted and back here. Like I said, it doesn't have to be perfect because when your face looks like this, it's just, does not matter. See how I'm not putting all that red? Because I'm going to go back in with the red all around here. Okay. Now, so I can find. We're going back with the red.
What do y'all think? And then, I don't know. I don't know what color I should do down here. Should I do like a dark black? I don't know. And just to let you know, uh, I'm not going to add the blood right now because I am going to be meeting her, so I am going to be driving like this. Um, so I will do the blood when I get over there. So I'm going to have to try to see how I can do that so y'all can see how I do it. Um, but... Um, so we'll figure that out, but I will let y'all know how I put the blood on and what I do for that final touch. So I will be right back. Just going to add the contact, the eyelash, and figure out the lipstick on which one I shall wear, but I'll be right back. Okay guys, so I went ahead and put on black lipstick, and I went ahead and just put on little safety pins. I just attached it to the part where it's already flappy. I did it off camera because literally as I was about to put on the eye contact, I'm like, I probably should wait until I get to where I'm going because those are not, these are not like, you know, I can see. The other one's a little bit more, I probably shouldn't drive in them. So I'm gonna do that when I get over there and I'll add the blood. Just wanted to let you know, I added these little touches, but I will show you when I get over there, the final look. So. Come with me guys and let's go to this photo shoot guys. I'm back. So I went ahead and put on some blood, some fake blood. Um, the only thing I got is this little tool right here that comes with it. I just put a little bit of blood on it and just dab it. Just to wherever you think you know you need it. Even if not, just put it on there. See? Look at this. Just go ahead and put it there, put it right there, make it a little bit more out here. And ta-da, y'all are done. Okay guys, so this is the makeup holding up pretty good. And I'm just waiting because we're almost done with the photo shoot. Okay guys, so we are done with the photo shoot. And I'm going to go ahead and take all of this off because... When I got here, I drove, but now I'm going home and I'm gonna go ahead and take all this off. So nobody's driving beside me and going like, what is she doing? So yeah, guys, hopefully you all liked this look and keep posted for more videos. Thank you so much for watching this journey. You know, pop, thumbs up, subscribe so y'all can see and be notified whenever I get more videos and more tutorials like this guys so yeah enjoy the pictures i'm about to post of my photo shoot Mwah. bye guys